everybody. Good morning. This is Jean here. Jean True Love from True Love Quotes for You. Just wanted to say hello to you this beautiful morning here in Pennsylvania. My husband and I are just going to be um, going out for a little while. A couple of you have said you haven't seen Elliot, um, not Elliot, Ma um, Ian and Maxwell for a while. They'll be on. They've been busy. They've been busy. Um, I don't have any t sewing today. We're, we're spending the day with our um, our a couple of our sons, I forget who's a couple of our kids, um, for lunch and everything. But I just wanted to share with you something that I just got, I just received. And it just made my day. And I just thought, well, you guys, it'll make, maybe, maybe it'll smile too. About 20 years ago, yeah, a good 20 years ago, I had made my brother, uh, I have five brothers, four of which are living, um, older brothers. Um, my next up brother, Donald, who you have met with my sister-in-law, Patty. Um, I had made Donald and Don, Don and Patty um, a quilt when I first started sewing. And when I was, when I first started sewing, as I've told you a million times, I have gifted over a hundred quilts. I had gifted when, when I started quilting and up until about five, six years ago, really gifted a tremendous amount of quilts to whoever expressed interest in my quilts. Um, and Don and Patty, I wanted to do something for them. They, Patty's favorite color is dark blue and she accents her entire home with orange and white. Real pretty, really, really pretty. So I thought, well, I'm going to put my thinking cap on ages ago and I made them a dark blue, orange and white quilt. I did not take a picture of it. And it's so funny. So many of the quilts that I have made for people over the years, I don't have a picture of them. I, I've just, I was saying to Ian, because when, when, when Ian saw this, he said, oh, that's so special. Wouldn't it be nice if you had gotten a picture of all the quilts for the people? Um, because this has a lovely story. Um, and I thought, I don't, it was before cell phones, but we had cameras. I did take some pictures of my of my quilts but anyway make a long story even longer Donald sent me a picture just yesterday it said hey Jean Patty and I'm going to put it up right here let me just move over so the picture is going to be right here I keep our bedroom nice and cool and sleep with a duvet in the winter time when it's warm when it warms up we use your quilt <laughs> it's the perfect cover for spring and fall much appreciated and still looks good and I I've texted back I said oh my word a blast from the past this makes me so happy you made my day and I, it really did because I'm going to make my picture bigger of my quote I forgot that I had done I didn't have a picture of it I forgot that I had put Rick Rack on it you know me it's blue but it's really pretty I did remember if you would have asked me out of the blue I did remember I did my quarter circles to to make this design I do remember that but I had forgotten that I had done a like an orange and dark a navy blue batik I knew I had done orange and blue which Patty absolutely loves but you can't really see it but at the bottom of the quilt I had again this is 20 25 years ago I had an embroidery machine a Husqvarna when they first came out the designer one maybe you guys who um, are garment sewers or whatever have re remembered the Husqvarna designer one it was one of the very first um, at home in embroidery machines it is I still have it but it's fairly obsolete there's fl floppy disks and you need a reader and the, the it's come so far um, but I still have it it works as a lovely regular machine also but I had embroidered their name on the bottom of the quilt in orange it's really good and then I obviously used my my uh, feather stencil my quilt pants my feather stenciling I put white rick rack I put orange rick rack I used an orange and white dot. I'm just looking at it. It's really, really very pretty. And they have had it for t over 20 years, maybe 25 years. It's a long time ago that I made this quilt. And they've put it away. I completely, utterly, absolutely forgot about it. But dear Don and Patty thought to send me a picture of it. It's obviously been washed a million times. And it's really held up. I'm just so happy. I just wanted to share that with you. It really made my day. As I told them, that made my day. A blue quilt. Go figure. All those years ago. But I gave it away, didn't I? <laughs> it's so pretty. Anyway, I wanted to thank Don and Patty. Um, I, I have introduced them to you before. Um, my dear brother. I have, uh, like I said, I have five older brothers. My brother Warren, my second brother, um, down from the top. He died um, when he was 38 years old of leukemia. Yeah. 
30 years ago or so, 35 years ago. And um, yeah, that was sad. But I have four remaining brothers left, Kenneth, Wayne, Scott, and my brother Donald. So anyway, I just wanted to share that with you. I think that would make you smile. So have a lovely day, everybody. Keep safe, keep warm or cool wherever you are. And um, yeah, we appreciate you as always. Love from the true loves. Have a lovely day.